Hello guys and welcome to another profile tree video. So today we're going to be going through the different HTML website templates. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started. Okay, so of course uh, it can be a little bit overwhelming to choose a template or even to get started with a website, especially if you are using uh, some of the website builders or even if you're creating one from uh, using visual code or anything like that. Now, the most useful thing to do is to actually hunt or look on Google for some of the available templates online. So this video should hopefully help you find some of the website templates that you're looking for. So yes, we'll go ahead and get started. So starting off with the first one here, we have nice page. So this is the HTML5 uh, builder. So these are the generators as well. So you could download this if you want to. And they do showcase a couple of different designs, as you could see. And it even goes through the different features that they have. So there's a couple of showcases for them. And of course, the uh, you can have this as a plugin for WordPress or pretty much export that theme onto WordPress or if you use any other um, website builders. So that's pretty much uh, what that looks like. It's, it's like Elementor if you think about it. Um, we can go ahead and check out the different website templates that they have. So these are some of the few that they offer. So they have pretty much every category that you can expect. Uh, as you can see, just scrolling on through here. And they even offer, as well as that, some free website template block designs. So there's one there with a full width slider. Uh, they've got an about us. Just a couple of different parts that you may want for your website. And of course, they offer at least 10,000 plus free website templates. And it's always updated. So last it was updated was 7th of March. So th that's pretty good for what it is. Uh, so you uh, pretty much have like HTML templates as well. So that's some of the HTML templates that you could pick. And if I go ahead and click on one, so there's one there for a beauty one, which is H&M. So if I click on that, there's a couple of ones that you can download. And say I wanted this one. This could be downloaded for Windows or Mac. And you can create, of course, some nice websites using WordPress. Of, of course, HTML5 as well, or Joomla. And requires no coding at all. Mobile friendly, easy drag and drop. So it's just a nice uh, template to work with. And that's what you're looking at. And yep, you could pretty much just download that. So that's one of them here. Uh, one of the areas where you can find free or paid for uh, templates. And of course, there are the there's the website uh, or the WordPress website builder, which you can uh, they go ahead and advertise the three here, which is the HTML website builder, WordPress website builder, and the Joomla or Joomla page builder uh so what we'll do is we'll check out a another one um where you can grab some of the html templates so here's another area where you can get some free website templates uh for html and uh, this one's called webflow.com and of course, they've got their products here. So you could choose for e-commerce, of course, for design, editor, anything like that. And just below, they have quite a few of the free ones. So depending on whether you're creating a non-e-commerce website or an e-commerce website, you can pretty much pick from the following there. And they're all created for by Webflow themselves. And of course, some of uh, some uh, people as well. So if we go ahead and click on one, uh, pretty much you're able to use that for free or download it. And of course, you can preview that in the browser as well. So that's how it looks in the browser. 
and you can use that for free if you want to. Uh, but of course you would have to sign into the account. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much uh, how that looks like. It also gives you an overview of some of the features available, some web fonts, symbols, responsive navigation, responsive design, uh, content management system as well. Uh, then you've got some support as well by Webflow. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much a, a place where you can grab some free website templates. Anyway, we'll go ahead and check out another one. Okay, so our next one here is Colorlib. Now, this one is HTML and CSS website templates, so just a little bit better there. And of course, you can uh, go to the WordPress for themes as well. Uh, they do have some free ones here, uh, and they offer some of the different uh, ones there as well uh, to use. Now, of course, of co uh, there's one there for Bootstrap 5, Business, Nonprofit church. So these are the different categories that you could use for HT, um, for your HTML uh, template. Now there are a couple of different ones there. As you can see, there's the uh, pick the website uh, template you love. A couple of different ones there. Host hub, uh, cruise. So they're just names basically for those particular uh, templates. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and preview one now. So we'll do the glint. So here it is, there's the Glint template that's been opened up. And of course that's made by an individual there, as you can see. So it gives you a little preview, some description as well. And you could preview it as well from the site. And that's what the template looks like. The HTML template. You can see how modern it is as well. And the use of animation of it. So as I scroll down, you've got some animation popping off. So overall, just a really nice uh, web design there. And then of course, I can go ahead and pay for that. So you've got a single membership or a single a membership or a lifetime. So that's for life. So it's pretty much $349 for it. And they have some similar templates as well. Uh, as you can see. And of course they do offer some free themes. So these are the ones from their uh, WordPress. Uh, so I can demo that as well, just to have a look at it. And this is how it looks. And as well as that, I can download that and I can find the theme documentation. So this is pretty much the Shapely demo one. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much uh, Colorlib. So it's easy enough to use. Uh, well, it, it's easy enough to navigate your way around. You've got some premium themes as well. And you've got some web uh, website templates, of course, going back to it. And whatever category you have, you can just search it up and you'll be able to find what you need. So a whole load of different templates to choose from. Okay, so moving on here, we've got the next one. And this is the UI cookies one. Uh, they've got some free responsive uh, bootstrap themes and HTML templates. So that's something that we're after here. And of course, it says here that you can use them for personal use, for business, or for commercial usage. Now, uh, the way to get through there, of course, is just to select the Browse All Themes. Of course, just ignore all the advertisement. And you'll have a load of different options to choose, either by category, or you can, uh, uh, you can do so by searching. Now, there's one there for entire site, and if they've got a list of different uh, HTML uh, templates. So even if I selected one for businesses and services, and then I go ahead and search. So it'll take a little uh, minute here to search up. So say we would have, um, let's see. 
So if we go back here and we look for marketing, just say we wanted to do something for marketing. So there's a couple of different ones there that are for free. So here's a one page uh, template. Of course, you would have to go through the ads and you could do a single template for $15 or all templates for $59. So all templates being the home features, uh, revisions, pricing, FAQ, things like that. And you can also demo it just to see how it looks. So if, of course, uh, what it says there is for a single template, you'd only be paying for the one. Uh, so this is the one page uh, template anyway. So that's how it looks, nice and modern. And yeah, so you can pretty much select the all templates as well. And that's what it uses, CSS3, HTML5. And of course we've got some reviews there as well. And they do have other options. So if we just go back and We'll have a look here. So that's the marketing one. And we'll go up to the free templates again. So this one's the free education responsive template. And there it is, there's one for free. So must leave footer credits in place. So basically you're able to use this as long as you provide some copyright. So this is pretty much that copyright there. And that's how it looks. And of course there are optimization as well for desktop, tablet, and for mobile. And you can go ahead and download that if need be. And you can select other products as well for in light. There's one there for a restaurant. Uh, but of course, as long as you leave the credits uh, where it needs to be on the footer, then you can go ahead and take it for free. So that's one of the ones there. And of course, there are other ones to look through. So pretty much, yeah, uh, that's pretty much some of the ones that you could use for HTML templates. Uh, I, Of course, I keep going on and looking through different websites to look for some free templates or some paid for templates. Uh, but hopefully this video has helped just to get you to find some uh, websites, of course, to view some templates. If you guys have any questions at all regarding the video, just leave it down in the comment section below. Other than that, I'll see you for the next one. Thank you very much.